In the previous lecture, we described the reaction mechanism of the formation of the benzene disonium chloride. So we basically said that if we take the benzene molecule and we react it with nitric acid in the presence of sulfuric acid, we produce the nitrobenzene molecule. Next, we said if we react the nitrobenzene with these reactants, we produce the aniline, which is basically the benzene ring with our amine mean molecule amine group and finally if we take the aniline and we react it with nitrous acid in the presence of hydrochloric acid we produce the benzene disonium chloride molecule and we said that this final molecule is a very useful compound because we can use it to create many other important useful compounds and that's what we're going to briefly discuss in this lecture. So we're not, we're not going to focus too much into the mechanistic details, so we're not going to discuss the mechanism of each one of these reactions. Instead, we're going to focus on what reactants we have to use to form the following given products. So if we take the benzene disonium molecule and we react with hypophosphorus acid, we produce the benzene molecule. Now if we take our molecule, the benzene disonium, and if we mix it with our copper cyanide, we produce cyanobenzene as shown in this diagram. Next if we take instead our molecule and mix it with copper chloride, we produce chlorobenzene. If we mix it with copper bromide, we produce bromobenzene. If we mix it with the following reactant known as fluoroboric acid, we produce fluorobenzene. If we react with our Ki with potassium iodide, we produce iodobenzene. And finally, if we take our molecule, the benzene disonium chloride, and mix it with water in the presence of heat, we basically produce our phenol molecule. So we can see how the production of the benzene disonium chloride chloride actually gives us a compound that is very useful because we can use these reaction pathways to produce these important types of groups, these important types of benzene containing compounds.